What's up guys, Michael here. Today I'm gonna to talk to you on how to connect your band to your phone. A uh, couple of easy steps really to do it. It's just a quick video, so let's get down to it. So the first thing is to make sure that you have your Mi Band and you have it charged, okay? I have it on 10%, but as long as there's any, any charge really, that, that will do. And you have your Android device, okay? So you cannot use the Mi Band with iOS. You need an Android device with any kind of operating system, really. Um, and what we're gonna do is the first step would be to actually download the Mi Fit app. So you'd go to your uh, App Store or Play Store, sorry, and you'd go to search for Mi Fit. Okay, this is an official app, not a third party app. Just download that and then open. Okay, so once you open it, uh, I'm already logged in, but the first thing that you'd have is to log into your account. So you can use a Google account, you can use a Facebook account, I believe, and you can also have a Mi account. So if you're using a Xiaomi MUI kind of original operating system, I definitely recommend using the Mi account, but you can use Google account, no problem at all. So anyway, once you're there, uh, make sure that your Bluetooth is on, okay? So you have your Bluetooth on, I hope you know how to, how to do that. So you can see no per devices, you can tap here and try to connect to the device. If you simply go to profile, you'd have add device and ask you what is it. So is it band, watch, composition scale, smart shoes, anything like that. So we're choosing the band, which is up here, the box and the band itself. So we have a small message here. The following data will be collected after you pair the device, activity, sleep, heart rate, uh, so all that, we're happy with that. Allow Mifi to search for and connect to devices after turning it on. Go to settings. So we have to actually switch on kind of GPS here. Uh, so we go back and try again. Band. Okay. So keep the band close to your phone. So we're keeping the band close to your phone. And it's searching. Press the band, so right now we have a screen here to press on the band and it is pairing. And it's probably it's just due to maybe having a couple of different bands around. Uh, if this one has the kind of uh, initial pop-up message to press on it, that's how it gets the configuration of, uh, um, of the band itself. So we got a successful connection right now. It says that the battery is more or less than 10%, so we need the, more percent to update it so it's actually trying to push an update straight away to the band i clicked on ok <clears throat> and that's it really that's connected and right now there are just few extra steps so we can go and do those so you need to set again after you change device so restore the screen unlock um, so you can actually choose to restore um, so you can actually use the band itself to lock your screen, okay? And how do we do it? So we have to go to settings and security. So settings, security, S smart lock, sorry. There is an option called smart lock, okay? And if you go back to me band, allow for the access to contact. So me feed up wants to uh, access once the access to contacts photos media files on your device I will allow for it and then you can see settings security screen unlock tap smart lock so we go to smart lock and we need to put some kind of a pin okay let me do one two three four wrong pin okay so it's probably a pin that I'm kind of restoring the device from so let me just try my pin Okay, perfect. So what is a smart lock? Keep your device unlocked when it's safe with you. Smart lock can do this by recognizing signals like when your device is in your pocket or near your home. So basically when the device is closed by to your phone, when you unlock it, I mean, you don't have to actually unlock it. You just go main, to the main screen. Okay, so I'm happy with that. Um, so on body detection. So we're gonna switch that on. So when you're when it's with you, the device is with you and the band is with you and with it, it will unlock it automatically. Okay. 
trusted places so you can actually add locations of where when the device uh, is with you then it's gonna unlock it for example at home okay when the device is at home it's a safe place so I can actually have the device unlocked okay trusted face so we can actually even set up facial recognition and that's part of the me feet and smart lock uh, section okay so that's actually quite quite cool i'm gonna once again tap in my pin so unbody detection so that that should be working right now so that's it guys um so we've connected the device i showed you quickly how to use the smart lock on your device um and we can so you can see me band is connected okay Perfect, so we have a status, it's syncing right now. And that's it. Guys, thanks for watching. Let me know if you have any troubles connecting your Mi Band to your phone. Maybe I can help with that, okay? Thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching.